I am Errol Roberts. I am Sandra Roberts. And the name of our business is The Ice Factory. And we are hoping to get up broadening horizons how to market, manage, and make our businesses more profitable. The most impactful session thus far in broadening horizons is finance. It helps, it gives us a better picture of managing our finances in the business. And it helps us to keep track of the profit and loss of the business. The session I'm looking forward to is completing this finance session. At the end of it, it will give us a better idea as how to manage the finances in our business. The biggest challenge we're having so far is being able to manage our books because it's the last thing that is done when everything else is completed. At the end of the day, you are very tired. <laughs> One creative solution we have done so far in the business is the purchasing of the ice and water vending machines. This helps to eliminate labor costs. So these machines are placed in the public where the public could go straight to the machine and purchase ice or water 24 hours and as self-service. The machines help reduce three parts of the equation whereby right now we produce, package, store, deliver, and then it goes to the customer. But these machines remove the, the, the tree inside, so we just, they just purchase ice directly from the machine. So we got into the ice business accidentally. I bought a vehicle over 20 years ago, and in transferring the vehicle, the person I bought it from didn't transfer it. We arranged some meets at a gas station in Point to get the vehicle, the paperwork in order, because he was working in an ice factory. After two hours waiting, no one came. When I inquired from the people at the gas station, they said that the ice people went into receivership. So they no longer have an ice supplier. So their question to me was, do you sell ice? And my response was yes. And that was the start into the business. We started off with a freezer and ice trays. And after about six months struggling with the business, I started to look for an ice maker. Dial a wrong number. Looking in the classifieds, dial a wrong number, but then that was the right number of a person selling an ice maker. And that's where the business took off and grew to how it is today. The network formed so far with Broadening Horizons is that there's a WhatsApp group, and in that group you have all the different participants. Coming out of that, one of the people who are involved in Graphic works, we are talking up to them about having our logo redone. And also there is a, a big avenue for new customers from networking. We are indeed grateful to Courts for giving us this privilege for being part of this program. Thumbs up to Courts. So follow us as we broaden our horizon.